when he was arrested, he was no longer in a pair of uh, shorts and a T-shirt. He had on a pair of ladies' uh, skinny jeans. Everett Robinson is back in police custody after hundreds of Michigan State police officers and Ross Common County deputies searched for him around the clock for a week. The team kind of snuck up on their deer blind and they, they, uh, they forcibly opened the door, identified themselves. He was arrested without incident. He did not put up a fight. A deer blind up in the trees down this road is where the hunt came to an end. While Robinson was on the run, police say he stayed in a swamp for two days to throw off search dogs and broke into cottages and trailers. Michigan State Police helicopter pilot David Holliday, who helped in the search, says Robinson covered four miles while he was on the run. We know that if we can lock the suspect down in an area because he doesn't want to be seen by the helicopter, that that allows the teams to catch up to him. And in this case, it did. At one point, police believe Robinson may have even shot at the police helicopter flying overhead. But when they questioned Robinson about it, he came up with a different story. He alleges that it was an accidental discharge, that he was running and the gun went off, almost shot himself in the foot. But thankfully, no one was injured throughout the entire ordeal. And tonight, the community is thankful for the efforts of local law enforcement. Oh, huge. <laughs> because, I mean, we knew it was serious when we came Thursday. You know, there was a cop, uh, state police every quarter mile, and county cops, sheriffs, everything. And they gave us an escort all the way back.